Here at Simply Garden, with over 50 years of gardening experience, I believe in keeping things simple and productive while gardening in your own backyard. New Hampshire Zone 5, and we're actually getting ready to put in our final broccoli for the season. Uh, I had potatoes growing here. Did very well with potatoes, those that were uh, like that, yep. And we got my, my helper, uh, Carter's going to help me out here. So we had to actually took out some red potatoes right here, and we had over 55 pounds of potatoes we got out. A lot of potatoes. So, 55 pounds. And, and, and the, the uh, uh, Yukon Gold, we got about 35 pounds. That's very, very good. So anyways, we're going to go ahead and plant some broccoli. So first thing we got to do broccoli. is we've, you like broccoli? Okay. Well, here we go. So we're going to go ahead and plant broccoli. We're going to put some organic fertilizer in here. Yep, you sure can. Come along here. You just sprinkle like this, okay? Yep, just sprinkle on just in this little section here. All right. Here we go. While we're at it, I'm going to throw some in with the leeks over here, okay? Okay. All right, just going to... Easy, not too much. Not too much. Here we go. Just kind of in the middle there. Okay. That's right, like that, okay? Because the leeks will continue to grow. And I guess Carter's method is just throw it, right, huh? Mm -hmm. Get in the middle. I gotta throw it in the middle, though. Okay, that's good. That's enough. Right there we go. All right. So the leeks will continue to growing. In fact, the leeks will grow right through uh, all winter, all winter long. So now we're gonna do. We're gonna go and rake this in here. Okay. We were to we're gonna plant broccoli. We gotta rake it in the soil first. Okay. Get the uh, fertilizer mixed in a little bit on top. Yep. Okay, just nice and gentle like that. Nice and gentle. Okay, go back and forth. I'm going to teach you how. See? Okay. Can I Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Just a little bit. Not much. Not much. Okay. You got that for me? Mm -hmm. Just real gentle. Not real deep. Okay, keep it on top. That's a boy. You got the hang. Yep. Oh, got a little rag that I got in the compost bin. Okay. Perfect. We're going to go ahead and uh, space these out, Carter. About every 18 inches. And I'm going to put Okay. What? Oh, is that our decoration for this fall? Mm -hmm. we're okay. So then, we know that. Oh, it'll scare away the, it'll scare away the birds? Mm -hmm. Okay. For my favorite <clears throat> vegetable. So, here's what we're going to do. We're going to put a hole every 18 inches. Okay. Okay. So, every time I it's 36. Yeah, yeah you, Carter, you're pretty much, you know what? You're right. There's a little hole like that, not too much. Okay, go down there. One, One two, two three. F 54, right there. Yep. Yep. Little hole. Good, and then go a little further down. Do three more. One, One two, two, three. There we go, right there. Okay, perfect. Now, the next thing we're going to do, Carter, we're going to put a little lime in here. You want to know why I put a little lime in the soil here for? It helps the roots grow better. Roots, roots, roots. Yeah. Okay, hold on, Carter. <laughs> can yeah. I try? Sure, you can have some. It's just lime. Hmm? It's kind of soft. Put it in that hole. That right there. Okay, now give me the shovel. I want more. Give me the shovel, please. Okay. It's total. Eat. We're going to take this broccoli. Unfortunately, the broccoli has had a little problem. A, a worm got in it and made holes in it. But you know what? The middle section is fine. It'll grow up nice and big. But we're going to plant this deeper than it was growing so it'll grow better, okay? Okay, Carter, so watch now. There we go, see? It kind of crushes up a little bit. It's kind of gotten ripped down a little bit. All right. So, so we're going to plant the plant deeper than what it was growing. Okay? Thank you. Can I try one? Sure, you can plant one. Okay, so watch this. Okay. Well, first, I'll help you get it out because it doesn't break. See all the nice roots down there? Okay, now you can dig a hole. Dig a hole. I'll dig a hole. And then I'll put it in. Yep. Beautiful. A little deeper. Okay, Carter. Good. All right. Yay, I put it. So we'll put it in now. Take the dirt. And we and bury it. Pack it around. Yep. Perfect. Okay, next one. Our next spot. And 
very neat. Let's grab this one here. This one's good. No, that's that's a cabbage. We're going to do it at the end. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Here we go. Dig me a hole. Hold me get it out of there. Okay? Okay. We need a bigger hole for this Right there. Way. Right there. Yep. Give me a nice big hole. Beautiful, Carter. Nice work. Okay. I like your haircut. Thanks. All right. Good job. Hold on. We need a All right. Paper. Perfect. All right, put it down in the east and deep. Can I put all the dirt, put everything all back around there? Here we go. Whoops. Powder. And pack it in. Here we go. All right, slide it down. Get the next one right here. Boy, those worms did that. Those silly worms, huh? Dig me a hole, please. Marvelous. Okay. Perfect. That looks good. Alright. Okay, I'll put it in. Put it in. Got it? Mm -hmm. Beautiful, Carter. What was that? Okay. Here we go. Put a little powder on it? Sure, put a little powder on her. Sure, why not? I'll Beautiful. Put, okay. I'll put a little powder for the other one. Yeah, put some other ones there. That first one up there needs a little powder. Awesome. Okay. That's uh, called lime. Ground limestone. This one here looks good. Okay? Okay. Okay. So I'll show you this. So you kind of like this. Okay, put, you put your finger like this. So you okay. hold the plant up. See? Mm-hmm. Next time, I'm going to do You're it. You're going to do it next time? Okay, here we go. Here's a hole right here for you. Okay, put it nice and deep. See what it does? Broccoli grows roots along the stem. Okay. Not cabbage, but broccoli. Okay, we got to make some more holes now. Right here. Got to make some more holes. Hold on. Okay. Let's drink around the top a little bit. And what we're going to do, Car, between the lettuce, between the... Uh, between the broccoli, we're gonna plant some lettuce. A little later on, okay? All right, right now? now? Yep, not right now, but later tomorrow. I'll do it tomorrow. Oh, I do it tomorrow. Do it yeah, now. I gotta get, I gotta get going back to the bees, to the honey. Okay, so we'll put the little, put a little lime. You can mix it up with a shovel. Okay. Nice and gentle. Ooh. Okay. What good job you're doing helping me here today. One, two. Six, seven. So we're going to do eight broccolis. I'm going to do a couple of red cabbage and yeah. green cabbage. Yep. Okay. So here's a couple more broccolis. Look at how many more I got. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Right there. That's it. Up to that one there. Okay. Thank you, Hunter. I mean, Carter. All right. Um, actually, you're going to dig. Here you go. You need a couple more holes right there. So put a hole right there. Good boy. And Papa's going to go ahead and uh, wrap this up here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Get one more here. All right, so that's all the broccoli planted. Oh, look at this big oh, nice, beautiful. We love seeing worms in the garden, don't we? Huh? Mm -hmm. That's very important. Well, there we go. We got the uh, red cabbage planted. Some uh, regular. Uh, Green cabbage also. Um, I think it's called a uh, rock mammoth or something like that. We got some lettuce interplanted with the broccoli here. Uh, some is like a romaine, a uh, loose red leaf, and then a, a little on the small side, but a, a butter, uh, butter crisp lettuce over here. So we're going to give it a good uh, thorough watering now with some fish emulsion. And um, it's going to get a little cooler out, so it's kind of good timing to, to, to plant this. 
it was in the you know upper 80s the last couple of days so I've waited putting this in because it just gets a little too stressful for the uh, plant to handle that heat but a uh, nice good drink of fish emulsion will get these off and running quite nicely and uh, let's keep keep it well watered in case we get a few hot days, but I think next week's going to start cooling down a little bit up here in Zone 5, Southern New Hampshire. And actually, you know, it's, you, you can really put the stuff in. I mean, it's it's amazing. I've had this broccoli do quite well into October. Um, I do have to cover it sometimes with blankets. If it gets too cold, you know, middle of October, I get some, some cold nights down in the upper 20s if that happens. It's very rare in this, this climate here, but I figure between the middle of October of August to middle of October I should be able to get some broccoli because uh, these plants are a pretty good size and I'll go ahead and put some uh, BT uh, which is basically a product that helps uh, if, if the worms do eat it they digest it and it messes up their digestive system so they die it's not poisonous on the plants at all but it keeps down the worm problem and also I'll hit it with some powder um, and that's a general all-purpose uh, organic powder that Helps keep the bugs off. So I just want to show that to you. Uh, some of my last fall plantings for the season. And um, hope you enjoyed it. And uh, make any comments below. Feel free to any questions you have. And thank you for subscribing and hitting the, uh, the, uh, the bell so you can get updates when I put out more videos throughout the week. Have, a, have an awesome evening.